what is up guys it's your boy chris aka the metal vlogger once again coming back to you with my second video uh really happy with how everybody uh so they really enjoyed the first video so hoping to bring you guys some good content tonight um on the way to get an oil change right now and to get a couple things because i'm going out of town to furnace fest uh after i go to the show tonight i'm going to come back home uh get a lot get a couple quick things that i need for my house take a quick shower and then i'm heading straight to my airbnb in birmingham well the outskirts of birmingham it's about a 30 minute drive to Sloss furnace is where i'm staying um yeah man just super stoked for the day uh like i said going to get an oil change and a couple other things and then tonight i'm going to see uh the Casey Strain, the Year of the Knife, and a couple other bands, Sanguia Sabog, and uh, I think Body Box is the other one. Uh, so yeah, really stoked for that show. Uh, I'm gonna bring you guys uh, with me to that one. And then yeah, man, it's Furnace Fest. Furnace Fest the rest of the weekend. Lots of content. Uh, I'm probably gonna do three different videos, day one, two, and three. Um, so expect all that next week. But yeah, man, I'm gonna try to drop this uh, this vlog by tomorrow, Friday, if I can. If not, it'll be early next week when you're seeing it, sadly. But uh, yeah, man, getting the day started. It's about one something in the afternoon. I'm just now getting out of the house, slept in a little bit because I'm off today. But uh, yeah, man, let's get it going. It's not much, but you know, it'll work. Alrighty guys, made a quick stop at Walmart. I'm not really good at filming uh, around a bunch of people in public just yet, so it was kind of awkward in there. But uh, rocking the drown and pull shirt as you can see. Got the good stuff. I needed a little small bag for a uh, furnace fest this weekend. They're kind of, I heard they're pretty strict on the, uh, the bag policy this year. So got me a little fanny pack, just something I can fit, you know, shirts, merch um wallet phone you know good stuff like that but uh yeah i'll uh, check up with you guys in a little bit um once again you know drown and pull one of the best bands in the world <laughs> uh i had to pull out the merch today man uh no but loki i do I, do, I am a big fan of drown and pull they're older they're older music at least a lot there she is my beautiful baby take her on a road trip this weekend Alrighty, guys the bag that i got Nice little satchel, man. You know, it's really not bad at all. I'm happy with it. It'll do me good at least for Furnace Fest. That's all I need it for. Got a little wallet compartment, you know, a little place to put shirts. It'll be good. This is the Holy Grail, guys. Best coffee in the world right there. This is what I spend most of my time doing, ladies and gentlemen i racing i did qualify second though you see the name qualified second baby all righty guys checking back in with you before i head to the show stop by my grandma's house to drop her off something she just recently broke her arm she's in her 80s so you know it's definitely hard for her right now but um yeah man uh super stoked going to see once again the acacia strain saying we have sabog i believe they're called um body box and near the knife super stoked for that rocking the signs of the swarm shirt that i recently picked up at the show i just went to um yeah gonna be a banger of a show tonight man i'm probably gonna be uh enjoying myself a little bit there so i'm not gonna have a uh a ton of clips but i'll try to get a little bit of each band for you guys so um yeah man really stoked to catch up with you guys uh, in a little bit when i get there and uh yeah, it's just going to be a crazy show. Never thought that I would have the Acacia strain coming to Pensacola again. Uh, so this is awesome. Really, really awesome. Excited for this show. Catch up with you guys in a little bit. Getting some food real quick at this uh, food truck place real quick. Pretty stoked. I'm going to be completely honest. I forgot what was all in this, but it is very fire and very hot. But I'm gonna kill this before I get in the show. Let's go.
fucking like trolley buses right here next to the venue. It's pretty cool. And there's parking and they got like all the bands right here, right by the venue. So but I just thought these were pretty random right here. Fucking random ass trolley thing. <laughs> update in the middle of the show um two bands have played so far year of the knife and body box both were fire uh bought a little bit of merch from everybody i'll show you guys that in a little bit but yeah man such a good show so far i'm about to go watch the last two bands sing with a bog and uh big casey a strain so yeah about to go check that out year of the knife killed it though man uh first time seeing them and they were awesome body box first this is the first time i really heard about them is this tour and they were really, uh, really awesome too, opening up the show. So I'm gonna get back in there and uh, and uh, try to uh, catch the last two bands for you guys. picked up some new stickers new body box sticker down there you can't see that year of the knife sticker and then support your local coke dealers and another year of the knife really 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 happy with my pickups <laughs>
which I picked up tonight, Year of the Knife, the Casey Strain. Figured out a close of the video at uh, this gas station while I'm getting gas real quick. Uh, such a good night, man. Uh, the Casey Strain, Sanguia, I don't even know, Sanguia Bog or whatever. I'm I'm too tired to even think of the name right now. Sanguia Saga Bog or some, something like that. Uh, Year of the Knife and uh, Body Box all put on an incredible show. It was so brutal. The pit was really good. I saw somebody lose a tooth tonight in the pit. Um, there was fist swinging. It was awesome, man. Really, really, really awesome show. The handlebar, the staff was amazing. The venue was really nice. Uh, it was my first time going to it again since it's opened up again, and it did not disappoint. Very good venue. Um, I'm just happy Pensacola's got that again. It was a staple before, and it's going to be a staple again. So, um, But, yeah, man, tons of, tons of good content coming to you guys. Uh, Furnace Fest, three days of that. That's going to be crazy. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to get this video up for you guys tomorrow. Um, but if I, I have to leave at, like, 2 a.m., so in a couple hours, to head to Birmingham for my Airbnb. So if I don't get it up tomorrow, it'll definitely be up Monday for you guys. But I'm going to try to get it up. I'm going to try to stay up and get it up for you guys tomorrow. So I uh, appreciate you guys for tuning in. I'm having so much fun with this, even though this is only my second video. And, uh, yeah, next up, Furnace Fest, guys.